Hi everyone, it's Nicole and I'm here with the new digital print release in our store this week. And this week it is cameras. And how fitting is it for scrapbooking, right? We couldn't do what we love doing if we didn't have our cameras. I mean, most of us now are using our phones, but it's still the camera phone. So I absolutely love these cameras. I think he knocked it out of the ballpark with these. I think my favorite are these ones right here. And we got eight different cameras. I think um, next week what we're gonna have is gonna have, because this is my favorite, he's gonna do this camera in different sizes. So you can have, you know, you can have it in different sizes, but let's go through all the different colors that we printed those in. And again, our colors are the same from digital file to digital file, so everything coordinates. So this is the red, and then you have blue, and you have purple, and I wanted to show you again, because I haven't done that in a while, but on your printer, and I have a video that says how to print my digital files, and I show you on there um, how I did this, and I have a playlist, Digital uh, Embellishments, and it's the videos under that. But I did intense printing. So basically I took the color option and I took that little toggle and I put it as dark as it'll go, and that's normal. So I could go again, even lighter than this. So this is the Pastel Paradise. And just to show you, that you get different colors. And I absolutely love that because with one file, you can get multiple different shades of your color. Okay, so we have files that are just one color because I know that some of us, we like to have, you know, let's say gray, it's a nice neutral color. We like to have a whole bunch of them. And what I like is, you know, you use, as scrapbookers, we like to make three embellishment clusters. While these, as you can tell, let's say there's only two. Well, what I would do is I would print right off the bat, I would print a couple of sheets. It cost you the same amount of money except for the cardstock. And then you can just, you know, cut your three that you need. Or you can do what I, a lot of times what I like to do is do two one shade and then a shade dark darker in a different cluster so that's always a possibility and then we have files that are assorted so we have six assorted files and we have um 16 i think different colors so it's quite quite a few or 13 different colors something like that but if you go to nicolejones91.com go under embellishments, you'll be able to find them all. And we sell them in the single sh single file, or you can get a bigger discount if you get a bundle. Okay, so this is pink. This is Radiant Rainbow, which is also one of my favorites. This is Summer Carnival. I think I might have printed pink twice, I did. And then turquoise, <clears throat> apples, and oranges. And I printed that one twice too. <laughs> and then brown. And cozy cafe. Then we have, we have peach, peach dark orange and then there's a bright orange and then there's light gray there's yellow there's seasoned spices and there's a few more that I didn't print off so I just want to show you sometimes the printer can kind of I mean I love them but if it's not working properly, this is what it'll do. This was the blue file. And then all of a sudden it started printing green. <laughs> and it was the blue file. And what it was, was my ink cartridges, they were clogged. 
So there's a function on your, your printer. Again, you can Google that, you know, Google is our best friend. So I would Google like how to unclog ink cartridges for and then blank, you know, the name of your printer. But it took seven times for me to do the cleaning and the deep cleaning in order to be able to print the right way. So sometimes your printer, don't forget, they need some kind of love too. They need to be uh, cleaned and all that in order to print. And again, here, this was before I cleaned it. It was brown and then it turned into purple. I mean, I'm still going to use these because, um, you know, I can use purple. I can use... This looks like it has two shades of turquoise on it. I kind of like it. So even though sometimes it kind of messes it up, you can still kind of use it. Now, I get a lot of questions, uh, you know, about the different embellishments that we have in our shops. In our shops, so I just thought I would show you. I think now we're at over 30 different embellishments. So we have... The viewfinders, we have them in the two inch, the one and a half, and the one inch. The one and a half and the one inch, you can get it with the heart or without the heart. And then we have tabs. We have it without polka dots and with some polka dots. I got a few different colors. We have frames with polka dots and then without polka dots. And that again, you can get them in all the different colors. And then you, we have some banners. And here we did a mixture of with polka dots, with some lines, with some hearts, and then some planes. And then we have two different variety of arrows. We have arrows with words. And then we have arrows um, just that you can just put them on your embellishment clusters. And then just a few words on the bottom. When I when we did this one first, and when I did this one, I thought it'd be awesome to have, uh, you know, some bigger ones with all the words. So how that's how those came about, and like I said, there's twenty or thirty some different you know different digital files. We have labels. I think three different styles of labels. We have tiny letters. We have with the white text, the black text, we have some circle ones, we have numbers, we have, I think one of my favorite that I've been using over and over again is grid paper <laughs> because we have, um, you can make it whatever size that you want. So we have two different size of grid paper. We have the small and the medium and you know some of them are one color and some of them are two-tone so i just thought i'd show you the different uh, like the variety of embellishments that we have in our shop and that's it that is the digital print that we're releasing the this week these beautiful little cameras and i want to thank you so much for watching bye